Hello guys, Pavel here. Welcome to another video tutorial. Today I want to talk about a way, uh, different methods to find out what the values, hex values or RGB values of a color you see on your computer screen are. So basically, let's say you you create a logo and you you notice somewhere really nice colors, you want to use those and you don't have a clue how to find out the RGB value of the color. So for that reason, for, um, in, if this happens to me, I use a little program called Color Pick. You can download it from this website. Click here and you download any version you like. Once you download it and install it on your PC, you open it and it works like, well, there's, there's a few palettes already in, so you can create new palette and there's a few chips you can populate with different colors and it works like that. Whenever you move the, um, this pointer, this arrow, the program picks up the color that is this arrow points to. So you can zoom in as well and you can see every single every pixel is visible and you can you can grab these colors to the program and uh, the values will be displayed. So let's say you want to check the colors got a nice red here so uh, to grab a color you press on the keyboard control and G. Let's check this blue here Sometimes it's a bit tricky, depending on your mouse sensitivity, but it is possible. And maybe at the end, one of these light greens ones. Okay. So once you grab the colors, you can uh, click on them and the values will be displayed. RGB is here, hex here, here's all the values. So you'll be able to to put these values into the program you're using and it should be pretty much the same color. Maybe not 100% the same, but it's gonna be close enough. So this program works really, really well, but sometimes on the web, the links or the buttons change if you uh, hover over them. So let's say if you want to have a button like the same color like um, on Netflix, it's gonna be difficult to use this program. Because once you point, that button actually changes the color, it's getting a bit lighter. So you'll be able to grab this one, let's do it, Control and G again. So you have lighter color, this one, but you don't have the this one that the, is not being pointed, if it makes sense. So if this something uh, something like that happens to me, I use another method. Uh, quite simple. Basically I press um, print screen on my keyboard so I create a screenshot of whatever I can see on computer screen. I open Photoshop, create a new file and paste that screen uh, screenshot so I pressed Ctrl and V and then I click on that color picker click here and here's here's the darker color so again the values are somewhere here these are hex values if you use it for making website and CSS you can use this uh, if you don't have Photoshop you can even use paint So I press again Control V. The screenshot is still in the memory of my computer, so it's going to be pasted. And then you grab a color pick, picker tool. And you click on it. That color goes here. If you click on Edit Colors, you will be able to see the values here. If you want to convert these values into other values, you can use a website. Um, with color converter you put RGB here and these are populated. Okay these were the few ways I used to grab a color from a website or a Windows application. I hope you have found it useful. Stay tuned for more tutorials about all <laughs> technology things. Uh, speak to you soon. Bye bye.